from Dallin J. Goods. Let us know how we can help you. <laughs> Hi, everybody. I'm Lynn from Ellen J. Goods. Thank you so much for joining us today on our little spring shop walkthrough. We are so excited to have you here. Our shop is a brick and mortar shop on Main Street in Medina, New York. We're halfway between Buffalo and Rochester. And we are um, not too far from Canada. We have a lot of Canadian folks that come down to visit us. And um, we look forward to having you stop by to visit anytime. If you can't make it to the shop, you will find most everything that we're gonna show you today. Well, a lot of things that we're gonna show you today are on our website at allenjgoods.com, or you can always reach out to Megan if you have any questions. So, how do they reach out to me? Oh, info at ellenjgoods.com. That's right. <laughs> Perfect. I'm going to be carrying the tablet around with me today so I can maybe monitor a comment or two. Um, Megan's filming from our, our, our little phone with the stabilizer thing, the old fashioned way, <laughs> so that she can really get into all the nooks and crannies and film me from every awkward and embarrassing angle. <laughs> I really try. I know you do. I know. So let's pull this up and see if we have anyone visiting today. I hope so. It's kind of a gray day here in Medina. And just let me know if you guys can hear me. And, um, oh, there we are. We're live. Perfect. I see one heart. Well, thank you. Let's give us lots of hearts today. Follow, subscribe, leave a comment, all of those wonderful things. And as you are popping on, oh, Laura Roy just got her box of Ellen J goodies. There's Judy, there's Lori Slate. Hi, Jennifer, it's good to see you. Jennifer, lots of people call me Ellen, but I'm actually Lynn. How about that? In fact, there's gonna be a lot of people that watch that call me Ellen. So um, we're, and then we have YouTube on the app. Let's check over there. It is, we are at this exciting Easter week. Um, hmm, Megan, how do I? Just click the YouTube app. I did. Um, I had it all open up to your it channel. It is open. I'm just trying to find my live and. If you go to your channel, you might just need to refresh. Got it. There we are. Okay, perfect. All right, and there's a chat going. There's a chat going on over there too. And I see Patty and um, Wendy Gerard and Deborah Bird, Kathy P, Lisa. D oh my goodness, you're all there. So um, why don't we get started, okay? Um, obviously, this is where we do our checkout and. Um, and yep, yeah, then come on over here. You'll see probably some things that we have uh, shared with you before that are still here and uh, some samples, uh, some pieces that we have done on our lives. Like, remember this? This was really I cool. I love it. It is such a great piece. Yes. And so, um, yeah, and here we are. JR and I worked our butts off yesterday. <laughs> If you follow us on Instagram and saw my stories, um, you'll see that we built um, we built that porch, that porch that he picked up in Holly, Michigan, and it is now in the shop. And I'm so excited because, of course, I'm thinking of all the ways that we can decorate it for all of the seasons. So. Um, we have Patty Hogan and Hope and Tammy, lots of you over there on YouTube. So don't forget, uh, let's see. And we have some new folks joining us on. <laughs> hi, Melissa. Hi, Carol, and hi, Shannon. Okay, so I'm not gonna be going in to answer um, comments. I really want to like kind of get through this. If you do have a comment um, or a question about something, please don't hesitate to reach out for us via email 
or that text group and uh, we can make sure that we get back to you and see your comment. I know that when we do this kind of thing, very often folks will say, oh, how much is this? How much is this? How much is this? Best thing for you to do is take a screenshot. Because we're on a little bit of a delay, it's tough for me to know exactly what you're talking about. Um, but if you send a screenshot, we're happy to help you. Also, and I think a great place to check first, we have a collection, Ellen J. Good's Spring Favorites. You can find that in the description above on Facebook, below on YouTube. And it's also just right there on the front of our website, Ellen J. Good's Spring Favorites. That is correct. And a lot of what we're showing today, you can find there. We worked yeah. hard to get it all on the website, so it would be easy for you to find. But surely, not Miss Shirley, but surely, you will find things that are not on our website and want to know about them. Uh, so we see lots, lots of folks joining us on on, you, on Facebook now, so thank you. Um, boy, our front windows, I don't know if you got a peek at the front windows when we came in, but we, I have, did. we have put some big, beautiful spring flowers up there, and we're starting to pull in some of our summer like furniture and those old cast iron pieces, the urns and all the stuff that I love so much here and that we are always looking for always for me it's got to be the biggest and the heaviest <laughs> and the most difficult thing to move and you'll see evidence of that as we walk through but let's um well here's our little spring um garden collection all of these are real touch oh my goodness the the hydrangeas the tulips we are getting a little low on some of these the poppies i think are probably one of my favorites megan they're so so pretty and these fun little bunches um i don't typically go for orange but we couldn't resist those right mm -hmm. couldn't resist all right and now why don't we swing the camera around this way and let's we don't want to end with that Oh, and then we could go oh, around. Okay. All right, that that works for me. It's all downhill from there. Sure. <laughs> okay, so there's our metal birds. Yeah, our metal birds. Um, so let's take a peek into this beautiful romantic corner here. Look at oh my gracious sakes, we have we just got in these beautiful um, kind of a dried effect faux florals. I'm telling you, I love these. And so we did a whole mantle piece here showing you that, no, you might not be one that is going to fill an urn like I did here, but you could get just a few pieces and tuck them into your mantle with just a, cu a couple of other rustic um, pieces. And I think that creates a really pretty effect. You don't need an entire pot of this on your mantle. I mean, we kind of go to excess here. Because we can. Because we can. How yeah. do I turn those lights on, I wonder? Um, well, gosh, that is a really <laughs> good question. We're learning as we're yeah. doing a walkthrough as well. But perhaps maybe just switch it out with to lighten up your mantelpiece just a little bit. What a difference. Just, just that alone. Lovely. I love it. Yeah. Um, this is new to the shop and these are these beautiful little, oh my gosh, they're like a fruit and floral garland little, um, they call it an urn, but I think what a beautiful little like a uh, bird bath or, you know, if that's put up on a pedestal, how pretty would that be in the garden? So pretty. All right. And... The bench, yeah, Rosie, the, the long church pew, I know. Oh, Oklahoma City, oh my gosh. Thank you, Nina, for popping in and, and uh, <laughs> how did we miss this? You know what, JR mentioned that the other day, like a uh, little bit of Christmas, we, it was just snowing yeah. here. Well, but because before funny. you know it, it'll be July and we'll be yeah. ready to start um, Christmas. We'll leave it up. Yeah. Okay, so I don't even have everything put up yet, but, um, Again, our cupboard full of ironstone. Uh, we have been, uh, man, we have been loving the big old cupboards lately. Mm -hmm. And wait till you see. Or they've see, been loving us, I wait guess. Wait till you see what came into the shop this week. Oh, my goodness. All right, check this out. I have one set of these. These, um, this little cow family 
and they're heavy and they're wonderful, but look at that. For all you farmhouse girls and guys, isn't that sweet? Just love it. Here's more of those dried florals. Um, our Sugar Boo collection. We try to get that on our website more and more. Good morning, Sandy. Um, Heather Rudolph is visiting in May. Ooh. Can't wait to see you. For camp, Heather? Is it for camp, Heather? Hi, Rose. Rose from Barrie, Ontario. You're not that far away. Not that far away at all. We've been a retailer of Sugar Boo for many, many years, and um, we just love them. We love them. Okay, hello, Susan, Nani, Connie. Susan, Nani, Connie, and Tammy. And wow. Shelly are all over on YouTube yes. as well. Okay. Um, and the beautiful wall. Oh my goodness. I have just been bringing up every gilded and gold and vintage frame and just those warm tones for right here. And I've been lucky enough to um, have these two. I just found that one um, a couple weeks ago. Look at that precious little vintage mirror. It's got the plank on the back of it. Oh my gosh, I just love it. So, um, yep, there we go. Cute little um, uh, paper mache house collections. They're done in that little ditzy floral. I think I've mentioned these before. Hey, you know what? I gave these as a gift for somebody for a baby shower mm -hmm. for a little girl. I just thought they were really cute little decor item. And um, yeah, and then the little, our little uh, clothing corner. Um, our sale on um, moi is really thinning out right now. Next up is going to be the t-shirts on sale, mm -hmm. which um, will keep you kind of posted on that. So yeah, I've been busy this week in the basement getting ready for that JRV cottage color paint launch yes. and um, that video will go live tomorrow. I'm not sure of the time, but that's going to be a collaboration. There's Debbie, there's Jamie, there's myself, there's um, I think three other um, DIY uh, stockists that are going to be um, doing a little collaboration over on YouTube. So you'll want to make sure that you catch that. Okay. Somebody, I cannot believe that no one, someone was willing to have us ship this, remember? Yes. And we were just like, uh, I don't think so. But um, that beautiful little urn, man, someone doesn't get it. I might have to take it home. Right? Mm -hmm. All right. Off topic. Sometimes I think I hear you say a name, Levon. I have a Levon grandson, said Joe Hall. Wow, Joe Hall, I don't ever hear that, but my third youngest son is Levon, and he is actually having a birthday tomorrow. Yep. How Levon old will David. He be? He's going to be 14. Oh and my I just gosh. cannot believe no. it. No, it's impossible. And I, I bet people mispronounce it all the time. That's something I did not foresee with that name. I still love the name, but it's wild how people mispronounce it. Yeah. Well, I get it. I do get it now. I really just did not foresee that. Yeah. All right. Um. Oh, oh we got it. Oh, my goodness. Like, we just got a few of these in. Look at these beautiful shrine pieces this one has all curved glass around the outside that is so that beautiful. beautiful beautiful piece i mean you can put anything in there change it for every season you really could i remember it's when just, we saw these i remember too and and i was like oh oh my gosh yeah but we we have uh we have another one too these little sheep are so cute these sheep are adorable so check these out oh my goodness they each, my mother was here bright and early this morning, grabbing her little, her, bird, her, bird, she, her birds. I bet she'll be back for a sheet. Yeah, but these, and they're heavy little, um, they're heavy little bud vases. And let me show you how these work, because it's so cool. 
So this is like a little iron braided wrap, okay? And it's got two little vases attached to it. And you literally wrap it around the sheep's belly. And he has these little carriers. So cute. And you just put a tiny little sprig of something in there. But really cute. Super, super cute. Here I just put one of a, a little velvet flower in there. Love so it. So adorable. Okay. Any chance of saying prices? Elizabeth, you know, most of them are on our website. Um, and like I said, you can always reach out to Megan. Um, it's hard for me to actually, um, because we're on a delay, it's really tough for me to know like what you might be talking about. So grab a screenshot and, and send us a text or, or email to, um, to ask about something. But Unless, first check that collection because we have, we did try to get a lot of this stuff up there. Yeah. Yeah. Okie dokie. Let's see. Um, all right. I'm not used to using the tablet. <laughs> I'm really not. Well, you're not used to doing this job at all. No, I'm not used to it at all. You're right. It's hard to do while you're doing what you're doing. Yeah. Okay. Um, I just hear people saying gorgeous, so cute. Oh, I'm really trying uh, think, to get it together so that she can come for camp. Kathy, that would be awesome. Oh, yes. That would be awesome. Thank you, Delray. We appreciate that. Um, okay, so let's, I feel like I'm going to have to like, we'll do a little swoop and then up the other side maybe. You want to show what these boxes do? Oh, these boxes. Okay, so... There are book boxes, you guys. You know, the, the paper mache ones. But then there are book boxes that are beautifully lined, beautifully constructed, and look at the set of boxes. I love these. These were another thing I kind of fell in love with. I think these are great for, like, journaling supplies, too. They are, absolutely. Yep, but look at, oh, they got, like, a little velvet interior. For all your secret treasures, like a stack of those on a coffee table, throw some remotes in there, um, you know, hide some snacks in there. Well, that's what I would do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We have our beautiful hardware bin of flowers. Um, it's starting to move into like these summery dried um, as we start to transition out of the bright, bright spring colors, but boy, there's still some really pretty pieces in here mm -hmm. that are so good. And, and those are, these are all on our website. Okay. Um, do a quick traipse through our DIY department. Yeah. yeah. Let's do that. I there's see a, Joanne. This is our Monaghan paper. Joanne Sykes from the UK. <laughs> good to see you. Do you want to show these? Yeah, these are pretty, aren't they? Just got these in, and I just think they're so fun. And they're, like, the heavy glazed. There's some really cool, like, crackle design. But each of them is a different. And 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 I, first, when I looked at them, I'm like, oh, I don't know. But then um, I was like, actually, those are really neat. I love them. Oh, look at the crackle. They're really heavy. Really nice. So, yes, into, showed Monahan. into yes. our new DIY area. We're still working on getting samples up, but JR got the lighting has been the buzzword for the last week. Yes. But he's gotten the lighting up in here, and it's so good. Hello, dear. Did you um, want to show behind the scenes? Yeah, <laughs> we weren't sure if you wanted privacy. While you were he's been lunch. in, I see him in, I've been here in the adding machine yes. and the, <laughs> all this and that. Hey, you guys, um, I've put also, if you check, if you scroll down the page and scroll down our page, there's, um, there's a category down toward the bottom that says sale, and you'll find a lot of really cool stuff in there. Some of the cool things you'll find in here are our totes as we are transitioning into bringing a new collection in. We just want to move some of these out. Um, there's not, not a lot of them left, but... They're there if, and if you cute. think they're really cute. They're really nice. And 
Then around this way, obviously our fusion mineral paint. Say hi, Miss Shirley. Hi. And please refrain from using your phone at work or clock oh, before you use she's it. She's probably on I'm our app. <laughs> Oh my goodness, our Debbie's DIY, our fusion, and um, look what JR did right here. I love this. We're trying to think, how are we going to show the colors for these? Because the, they're really narrow shelves here, so we can't put big tags. These were the tags that were in our previous spot, but um, these are just little magnets, so you can pull these off and um, check the colors, compare them one to another, but he just turned these on edge so you can see the colors. We actually have a shipment coming Friday to restock. Mm -hmm. All of our other papers, stencils, all the good stuff here. And Shirley, busy working away on, did I, I thought I heard the door. I think JR must have gone up because I did look. Oh, okay, okay, he snuck out on us. The live video has ended. No. Shop walkthrough, yeah. It's, mine shows it's still live and recording. Oh, that's interesting. I'll ask everybody. Are we here, guys? Oh, we're here. We're here. Okay. All right. Woo. I got a little, little scared. <laughs> the French <laughs> ephemera that we were... Hi, Mom. There's Mom. Love your shop. I wish I could see more, but you keep freezing up. Oh, no. Try going out and coming back in. Still live on Facebook. Cheryl, are we live over on YouTube? Oh, please. I wonder why those things happen. Um, yeah, so this, this little... Um, Yep, little old, showed that little, little old cart just has special little things for, you know, for your journaling, for just little ephemera, little bits and pieces. Here's some frozen charlottes, um, little watch face collections, all of brass letters, um, beautiful silk, uh, or not silk, but the velvet um, millinery florals are there. And then we have our beautiful big workspace. Why isn't that light on? Huh. I I don't know where all the switches are and at all anymore. So <laughs> I guess I don't either. I don't either. I turn it on. <laughs> but this but this one isn't on. Yeah. Huh. Has that ever turned on? Yeah. Whatever. Uh, no, we'll discover just, that. We'll yeah, it we'll out figure later. it out. Mm hmm We will figure it out. So let's see. I see. You are live on YouTube. Perfect. We're staying okay. alive. Staying alive. Here's our baby okay. Miss Barn Quilts. Mm -hmm. And now we into IOD land. Yes, IOD land. Oh, IOD land. Can we talk about it? What a release. Those of you that did get, let's see, Apothecary. Conservatory. And Conservatory. They're gone. Not forever. Not forever. But, but it they won't, won't be, be till back probably, until almost probably July. Well, really, for the probably won't be until the don't we do Chris? No, no, till our next release. Yeah, which will be you know toward probably in the summer. It's going to be in the summer. Yeah. So be thankful that you got them. Yes, Good. but we're, you just we're sold out. You'll have another chance, but not from us, and not right now. <laughs> not till <laughs> summer, just because exactly. we can't get them from IOD either. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see. We don't have our lights on here. Yeah, but that's because we weren't. That doesn't oh, yeah. control that. Yep. And again, we're not electricians. We've got our Tim Holtz and our, you know, all of our inks and goodies and stuff like that. So there's all our Tim oh, Holtz. Did any of you make one of these? Like, how adorable! Someone Gosh, just I sent love me these. pictures. They did. Yep. And oh they my turned gosh. out beautiful. Oh my gosh! Hi, Linda. Hi, KT. Yes, hello, Carla, just join. All right, hi, Joe. This is all Is the metal land. shrine new or vintage? Diane, it is vintage. It is not vintage. It is new. It is a new thing. Um, obviously, if it was vintage, it would be much, much, much more expensive than what it is. <laughs> okay. 
but they don't know the price, so they would Yeah, they don't. Yeah, but you can check it out on the website. All right, back to, let's take a peek here. There's Jar. Um, all right, let me... Okay, we still got everybody recording. Thank you so much, Charlotte. Thank you, Dana. All right, Delray, thank you for letting me know that. Okay. All right, so here we go. We're going to kind of back our way up mm -hmm. to the front, and uh, we'll end up at that little that little front porch. Um, I'm thinking next week or the week after, we might do a little vintage pop-up walkthrough. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Like to feature some of the our newest uh, vintage collections and finds, just because it, it's been wild. It has been wild since um, the IOD release and you know getting all the videos ready and all that. Just stuff. the month of March is crazy. Period. Yeah, it yeah. always is. It always is. Mm -hmm. So check out this cupboard. If anybody needs like an entire kitchen wall, there it is. Isn't that incredible? Like, it's, it's so massive. incredible. <laughs> JR. Yes. Come over here. Yes, I'm right here. Jonathan and you mm -hmm. took that apart. Mm -hmm. Jonathan, my son? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. When? Come I didn't on even know this that. Way. Yes, dear. Um, it was like. Four years ago, I think. Mm -hmm. Oh, like I that. do remember that. Yeah. I didn't know that was yeah. that. Yeah, we took it out of somebody's house. Yes. We, we were rehabbing. I mean, by we, I mean you and John. Mm -hmm. Yes. Me and Jonathan. Jonathan. And you know, <laughs> it's funny because, um, you know, they, they were rehabbing their kitchen. And Saturday, someone local popped in and said, I just had to see this cabinet. Oh. They saw it on Instagram, right? Mm -hmm. And said, do you know... I tried so hard to get my cabinet maker to do exactly this, and it just doesn't look the same as an old piece. No, no, <laughs> I'm like, no. Like, oh, I, lo I love it. And I, and I was even asking JR, like, oh, my gosh, can we somehow rethink the whole layout of our kitchen? You would have to have a different home. We would because... <laughs> or we could raise the roof. Yeah, we'd have to raise the roof. That would be yeah. wild. Yeah. The whole hallway coming in. Yes. Okay. All right. Is yeah. that all you need from me? Well, no, you might want to come in and talk about the little porch in a second. Oh, look, these are cute. We only have a few of these. These are these heavy metal. These are little candle holders, but look at them. And they come in two Slow. different colors. So there's this rusty whitish. Oh, and I and I just didn't, I couldn't find a pillar candle to pop in there, but isn't that the cutest thing? Yes. I love these. And then up front, I'll show you the other one, which is more of a patina, a uh, vertigree look. All right. Um, yeah, good stuff. Here we go. We okay, have... Do you want to show this? Sure. Yeah. Over here. Yep. Yep. You can see. Do we have the new Jean d'Arc here? We do have the new Jean d'Arc. It right it's up no? front. Okay. Yeah. So, guys, if you, I have not sent a, a message out about that to our text group because I know a lot of you um, get notified there about the new Jean d'Arc magazine, but we have a spring one and it's really pretty. Well, they're all pretty. They're all mm -hmm. wonderful. They are all wonderful. I'm just going to move on down here. Sure. Oh, it. Cheryl, can I? Can we deliver it to Charlottesville? Sure. Oh, Jr. Cheryl Macedo said, "Hi, handsome." I'm sorry. <laughs> Cheryl Macedo said, "Hi, handsome." No respect. She was talking to the cabinet. She was talking to the cabinet. <laughs> goodness these just came in these wonderful little concrete bird relics oh we had this company that we had dealt with before that did the, just the most fabulous little special concrete pieces and um these are some these are all concrete really cute really cute all right and oh, every time i just want to like they're just so sweet a little set of golden bunnies. So let me ask you this. Like, if 
if you do, if you collect, say, bunnies, we typically think of as, you know, Easter time or spring. But if you, if you collect rabbits, do you keep them out all year? That's what I want to know. We had rabbits out in the winter here. Yeah, true. I, I think so. Yep. I think so. Oh, Rose said, looks nice, all of us. All of you look nice. Hello, Danielle. Do you want to show this cabinet here? Okay, yes. Yeah. So let me, oh, I'll show you this one. These are also, we just got these back in stock. Um, these are beautiful little concrete relic birds, uh, doves. They're doves, but aren't they wonderful? And these you can put right out in the garden. Nothing is going to hurt them because they are concrete. Um, okay, so a new addition to the shop this week. And we haven't even totally gotten it ready yet. Look at this. It's pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. So here is the thing. These are all adjustable shelves. I just wow. think this is the coolest thing ever. These are all adjustable. And they have these little, little, uh, things that come out. Jar, I'll pop those out. But I think for display purposes, we're going to remove every one, every other one up at the top. And then down at the bottom, we've got all the wooden dividers that slide in to the bottom. So cool. Oh my goodness. It is just so, so cool. So right now, obviously we don't have it completely ready, but isn't that the mm -hmm. coolest, coolest piece? It's so amazing. It's amazing. Yes. It's amazing. Yeah. It's amazing, it's amazing JR. It's amazing. The little sheep. Did you show the little sheep here? Oh yeah, we have another little sheep. We have a we have a um a sheep family too. Aren't they sweet? Oh my gosh. They're so good. Um, yeah, Cheryl, I agree. And Shannon says that needs to be shipped to Washington State. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Mary Jo collects chalkboard bunnies. They're out all year. Good. Oh, my gosh. Well, you know what? When I look at a piece like this, I think instant craft room storage. Yeah. That's what I think, and organization. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I don't have a craft room big enough for that. Or a craft room at all. <laughs> okay. All right. Um... So we're making our way back up to the front again, and we're going to look at the, isn't that sweet? This is such a cute little piece. Yeah. And let's see over on the YouTubes. Is that woman wearing a bathrobe? <laughs> what woman? Kathy? <laughs> Oh, you mean Shirley? <laughs> no, it's a duster. It's a duster. Shirley comes dressed to the nines she, every day. Every, whether she's going to be on camera or not, yep. she is always, she puts us to shame. Whether we're open or not, she every day makes me feel like from. Yes, yeah, Deb says um, Shirley is always the snappy fashion yes, stuff. Yes, indeed. All right. Okay, and so now let's look at this sweet little porch. So when you enter the shop, here is that porch piece. This is a whole display piece. We're calling this Vivian's porch because it was made for someone many years ago and uh, she was a photographer and her name was Vivian. And so Vivian um, passed on and this has been was kind of floating around in storage, and it, it was also part of like a little vintage home decor shop as well. But um, we found it on Marketplace, and I showed JR, I'm like, we need to go and get this, or you need to go and get yes. this. <laughs> I'll wait here for you. <laughs> and, and yes, he uh, drove to Holly, Michigan, which is not too far from Flint, and bought this, brought it home in pieces, and yesterday we put it all back together again, and it is finally here in our home, in, in L and J Goods, and I just, I'm so excited and about I think it. it. Just think of all the seasonal fun things I you know, can do. I know, 
it's going to be so fun to decorate this. Even it, for staging the things that you make and photographing them because there's such natural light up here at certain times of the day. Uh, Danielle asked, what was that shelving unit originally meant for? Probably, Danielle, I'm sure it was, um, you know, like in a, in a, um, some kind of a workshop, workroom, uh, um, you know, for tools and supplies or hardware, that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. But all, but all of it interchangeable and adjustable, which is pretty awesome. So here's our little porch. And I love this. I absolutely love this little porch. You can see, look, I put one of our oval uh, wreaths up there, popped a little bird's nest in, and it just makes a great little welcoming display, don't you think? It's perfect. There's the new Yandar. Uh-huh. And I think it's a great spot to kind of feature um, but certainly if anybody comes, you can have a seat there in that chair and have someone take a picture of you. Mm -hmm. It would be adorable, right? Okay, let's see if anybody else. I know, Shannon's like, oh wow. Like, I know, isn't it amazing? It's so fun, it's so fun. And it's all like old, a salvaged wood. And we just put, we added these little corbels to it yesterday, but, um, but I think it's adorable. I think it's absolutely adorable. You should take a seat there and wrap this up. Well, all right. Um, let's, let's peek over here. Um, actually Jennifer, who is our friend from Cuba, I got this piece from her, this for display. There's the other color of that. Oh yes. And here's something else absolutely the prettiest little glazed pot but look at its birds all the way around the outside perched all the way around isn't that so cute and then here's the other shrine piece that's more of a you know rustic white um but yeah that opens up and you can display whatever you want to display in there so, so, so cute. Um, but yeah, I guess that is about it. Did it come with the black trim? It did, it did. Yeah, Mary Kay, can you imagine like Christmas time, fall? I, I just, like, I'm just imagining this whole thing like filled with pumpkins and 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 just a couple of like corn stalks on there. There's, there's just gonna be so many fun ways to do this, but um, but yeah, um, here's our here's the little birdies. These are also the little bud vases, you guys. And there's three different. There's three different ones. But look at how cute these are. And you just pop a little sprig, a fresh sprig. I, you know what I think of with these is um, Lily of the Valley will be mm. coming out soon, and they smell so good. And honest to goodness, it's like all you need is like a couple of sprigs of Lily of the Valley, and it. It perfumes your whole home. So um, anyway, so that's it. We're going to wrap up and um, let you guys get back to what you were doing. But thank you for hanging out with us. This is, this is where we do what we do. And we always enjoy having you come along on a little shop visit. And so um, again, let us know if you have any questions at all. Please don't hesitate to reach out to Megan at info at ellenjgoods.com. Shoot us a text in the text group. Take a, a screenshot if there's something you're interested in. Um, there's some cute little treasures and I know we, we go through this really quickly and sometimes you'll need to go back and watch it a few more times. What's the matter? <laughs> it's just somebody walking by. <laughs> You're making the camera jiggle. Okay, I'm sorry, my, hand, my arms are tired. All right, well, um, I'm going to sit down and... I'll get Shirley to bring you a glass of sweet tea. <laughs> yes, and maybe a little sandwich or something. Okay. Because I am hungry. Okay. I haven't eaten lunch yet. Okay. <laughs> All right, you guys take care. 
and we will see you tomorrow will be a little video um, for the Debbie's DIY paint collection, the JRV color, new color collection. Cottage um, colors. Cottage colors. That'll, that'll be live on our website and on YouTube. You'll be able to watch that little collaboration video. So, um, yeah, I guess that's it.